Thank you, emotional support crew. You're very welcome. I'm gonna have to blank your reg out now, yeah. like that. <laughs> Some might steal your identity. Yeah, they can have it. <laughs> can have your job. Good luck for today. Thank you very much. See you later. See you in a bit. Bye, Bye. Andrew. See you later. Take care. Good morning, Chris. Good morning, Dean. How are we? <laughs> We're all right, mate. How are you doing? I'm excellent, thank you. I'm looking forward to this. It's been nice to uh, see you again after all these years. Yeah, looking and forward so, to today's walk. I'm very proud that you managed to get after Thwaite. Yes. And we a good day out now, off yeah. to Middleton. And uh, yeah, let's go and do this. Let's we? do it. Let's go and do it. Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to the Penam Way Adventure. Day nine. Day nine. I've said it already, but. Kinder Scout seems like a lifetime ago. So today I'm walking from Tan Hill to Middleton in Teasdale with my good friend Chris. Hello! Chris aka Pilgrim Chris on all good social, social networks. <laughs> um, yeah, I've not seen Chris for a while. Chris was my uh, companion on the 2013 adventure and well we all know how that um, went down because I've spoke about it at length over the last couple of days but yeah, it's great to see Chris again and it's really great to have Chris along on this section that I'm not familiar with and forging like new memories in my mind about locations and stuff like that. Chris came back in, was it 2015? Yes. 2015 yeah. and, and completed the Pennine Way. Um, we're like 10 minutes in and my feet are absolutely drenched. <laughs> <laughs> there was a comment come through yesterday, beware the bogs of bows. And uh, these are probably the bogs of bows that the gentleman was talking about. Um, yeah, there's no definitive path at the minute, but it's fine. It's a little bit cooler today. I've got the jacket on because there's a bit of a breeze, but it's gonna be a good day. Nice day of uh, chatting and of views. So let's see what happens. The bogs of bows. We'll go this way. Oh, the bogs of bows. And you know what? It was a new sock day today as well. Oh, that's lasted all of five minutes. They're gonna stink. Sorry to the owners of the guest house that I'm staying in tonight. It's going really well across that mauling section there. Um, it really was boggy. Uh, the gentleman was right. We did have to cross the dreaded bogs of bulls. Um, yeah, but the path's a little bit more defined now, which is good. Beautiful walking. Uh, well, and there's so many tutorials for it. <laughs> well, we've uh, bumped into Murray and Julie again, and they're armed with the king of biscuits, Hobnobs. Really fantastic to see you both again. I, I thought that might be it when we parted company in Hawes, but you guys set off a lot earlier than me, or I should, I set off a lot later than most people do, so yeah. <laughs> okay, so we're heading towards, I think it's God's Bridge. We're not doing the Bose Loop because that's an added bit of uh, extra mileage that we don't need to do. Um, it's a fully sanctioned loop, but as we're carrying on to Middleton Teasdale, and we're not staying in Bows or anything, um, there's no point doing it. So back there, Murray and Julie, really great to see them again. Um, I had thought, you know, because I know I'm not gonna see Rob again, although we've been texting. Um, won't see Rob again on the trip. I thought that I might not see Murray and Julie again, but yeah, great to see them. We're continuing on. Um, not so boggy at the moment, which is all good. I think we're past the bogs of bulls, the uh, the dreaded bogs of bows, so we're all right. It's going good. Bridge of Gods, a nice little natural bridge here. Lime kiln, possibly. Yeah. Okay. We just stopped for a bite to eat there. The rain is starting to arrive a little bit. But um, funny thing is, um, 
Chris has bought hobnobs with him. Lisa bought me a fresh packet of hobnobs. Uh, Murray and Julie have got hobnobs. Um, a couple of people on Twitter have been talking to me about hobnobs. My friend Andy, who I went to Yosemite, he's just sent me a picture saying I'm making him put on weight because he's got hobnobs. So, I haven't got shares in McVitie's or anything like that. We're now going underneath the A66. It is. <laughs> Bit of a shelter, isn't it? Look at that. That's all right. Uh, we're just doing a tick of the balls off the windows. <laughs> but at least it's a bit uh, uh, skits, isn't it? The jog. Eight to the fifth nineteen. Team Custard Cream, Pennine Way North. We are Team Chocolate Hobnob, 2019 Pennine Way North. Go team! <laughs> Shared facilities as well. <laughs> the going's really good today. The miles are flying by. I'm enjoying it, mate. I'm so glad you're here. Thank you very much, I'm enjoying it too. Trying to fall off the end of that bridge there. But we're probably around about halfway now, would you say? About halfway. Yeah, excellent. Nice little climb there, out of the valley. Another bit of a climb coming up. I believe that's medicated grit for the grouse. Sure that's what I hear, read that it was in the peaks. You know what time it is, it's, it's hobnob time. It's hobnob time. <laughs> Thank you. I think this might become a new tradition on the Pennine Way. I think it might just have to. Have your hobnobs, <laughs> have your right. hobnobs and share a hobnob. I'm going to see if I can uh, uh, invest in McVitie's this afternoon <laughs> and buy some shares. You might be getting a phone call soon yeah. asking you to... <laughs> be a brand ambassador. <laughs> oh dear. That's going to do nothing for the waistline. This is a godsend, it's been spruced up a bit since I was here last. This is a fantastic place, Clove Lodge. It's like an honesty shop slash, um, it's like a bunkhouse at the top there. Donations welcome, uh, half it goes to search and, search and rescue. So, fantastic little place. Isn't it just? It's great. We'll drop some money in there. Rise this place in because they're sitting out in the cold and we're in our stuff here now. This is amazing. That's an absolutely fabulous place. Yes. I could quite easily live there, I think. <laughs> Toilets, place to stay. There's tea, coffee, everything you can ask for. On the sign there, it says I think there's cakes in the fridge as well. I didn't look in, but I know. Um, I was following a lady that did the Pennine Way with her daughter for charity last year, Nikki, and I think they stopped there. I'm sure they did. Or at least they stopped for refreshments. What a great day. Okay, we're now dropping down into Bouldersdale, and we've not got far to go now, really. Um, We've got to climb out of the other side of this valley and then we drop down into Teesdale and then it's not far at all to Middleton in Teesdale. And Lisa was talking the other day that they had uh, pizza for one of, the, one of the staff they left and they had pizza. And I've been thinking about pizza for the last few days. So if there's a pizza place in Middleton, Teesdale, I believe there is, I shall be sampling some of the delights. <laughs> Usually it's uh, chips that I crave. I mean, I could eat chips now, no problem. But yeah, I think pizza tonight. I remembered the other day that I'd bought my hat with me. Um, it was in one of the pouches in the bag. And in the comments the other day, I, someone mentioned that I should be wearing a hat. I think it was one of my fellow gingers. Um, but yeah, I'm wearing it on a cloudy day. 
but everyone knows that us gingers can get burnt on cloudy days or under street lights so I've got it just in case just in case the sun does appear again Hi there mate, you alright? What's your name? Stephen. How you doing? Nice to meet you mate. We've been you on your journey, all some tea time treats sort of things. So, uh, Excellent. How you doing anyway? How's it's going stuff? good, it's going alright. Um, obviously thank you very much for watching the journey but uh, yeah, whereabouts have you walked from? Um, we're just about half a mile down in the valley sort of thing yeah. so I'll join you for 10 minutes. If... Excellent. You Welcome aboard. Now I don't know if you know where you're <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> so. Doing a little... Uh, Hi Sharon, you alright? Nice to meet you. I'm in, man. <laughs> How are you? Yeah, I'm good, I'm good. Good. Got the ball in the ball. See you later. Will do. We're only about a couple of miles out of Middleton in Teesdale now and the going's been really good today. I probably said this already, but the fact that Chris has been along, we've just been chatting all the way and the miles have just, well, gone somewhere. I'm not sure, and so is the time. It's now about 20 past five, I believe, something like that. And what time was that? 10 to five. 10 to five. And yeah, we did set off a little bit later this morning from Tan Hill and Steve and Sally, thank you for waiting. I admire your dedication. Uh, I think they've been there a couple of hours. <laughs> but it was really great to meet you. This is the path for tomorrow, but today we're going to head up into the town. Oh, I'm going to tell me about that. Might stop me buying the next. <laughs> the River Tees. Here we are, just arriving in the town, and what do I see? Oh yes, here we are at the pub, and right next to the accommodation. That'll do nicely. Here he is, Chris. It's been absolutely fantastic, mate. Oh, my Good friend, it's been here. super. <laughs> Honestly, after all them years, you know Yes, what I mean? it's been good. And uh, you, you're, you're going to breeze it now, I reckon. I don't think there's going to be a problem. I'm feeling quietly confident, but we'll see how we go. Every day as it comes, uh, that's it. Just still a way to go. Comes. It flew yeah. today. It's, been, yeah. it's absolutely flown with nothing, not, nothing but talk. Yeah. And uh, the hours have flown by. Yeah, I've enjoyed it. it. It's been good to see after these years. Yeah. And I'll try and catch up with you Yeah. at the end. Yes. See how that goes. That goes. Excellent, yeah. Perfect. Thanks a lot, mate. No worries, buddy. I'm going to get soon. myself sorted. I'll let you carry on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then there was one. Right, pizza, I think, before I check into the uh, accommodation. Oh, look at that. What do you think? Another bath time edit? <laughs> That's what we like to see. Good upload speed. Okay, so another fantastic day on the Pennine Way. As I've said earlier on, it's really great to have Chris along today. It meant a lot that he drove in um, from the East Coast, like an hour and a half to come and walk with me today. And thankfully, because Lisa's been over this weekend, it worked out nicely logistically. And yeah. Huge thank you to Lisa, aka the Emotional Support Crew, for coming up this weekend. Um, it's a bit strange to be on, on my own again. Um, but yeah, I'm going to transfer all the footage to the camera, from the camera rather, to the phone, get editing and get uploading. Tomorrow's walk is from here, Middleton and Teesdale, over to Dufton. And we're going to take in some amazing sights, high force, low force, hike up Nick. It's going to be good. Right. Thanks for watching and I'll see you tomorrow.